Hey, what's up you guys? Welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, hi, hello, I'm Lydia. And if you are new here, make sure you hit the subscribe button, join the growing family, turn notifications on, and while you're down there, give me a thumbs up because it really does help me out. And there's a fucking siren. Today I want to talk a little bit about overcoming anxiety. Now anyone who knows me knows I do struggle with going out and I have done f since I came out of hospital really and honestly it's kind of starting to really affect me. I can't go out the front door without having a panic attack and even with benzodiazepines because I take lorazepam to go out with I still can't get out and it's got to a point now where I feel like I'm developing agoraphobia agoraphobia. I'm just so afraid to leave my room and it's no one's fault other than my own because I've basically isolated myself to living in my room and that's not good. Honestly living in a way where you don't leave the house is such a negative way to live because you're like me, too terrified to step out your front door and I like going out and about and I'm going to my mum's on Friday today if you're watching this and I'm gonna be going out. I, I have to go out. I have to get on a tube two tubes and I have to get on a train and I have to go to London Euston. Euston is not a quiet station, it is busy and don't I know it. Anxiety is a fucking monster. Honestly living with anxiety is hard, it's exhausting and nothing I say can ever truly demonstrate how bad anxiety is to live with. I genuinely think that I've pushed myself into a state of agoraphobia just because I can't leave the house without having a panic attack. I can barely go downstairs to get my medication and food. It's... I'm not living a good life like this. Like, I want to be okay. I need to be okay. And honestly, I don't even know what I'm anxious over. Like, what's the big deal? It's going out. It's not gonna kill me, it's not gonna cause any harm. Why am I so anxious to leave the building? It doesn't make any sense. Which makes it even harder because you don't know what you're fighting. If I knew what I was anxious about I'd do whatever I could to resolve that. But the thing is I don't know what I'm anxious over. So I can't do anything. It really is a lose-lose situation and even the thought of going out is really fucking with me like right now i'm thinking i could go to the shop and get some dr pepper for the train on friday but at the same time i'm like you don't need to do that you can just buy a drink on the day it really is a, a catch-22 And I don't know what I can do to improve things. Because living like this isn't any way of life. I'm at a point where I don't even know how to live life. Because until about three weeks ago, I was going to Weatherspoons every day, I was going to Hammersmith, I was going to Elam Broadway, I was going to Westfield, I was going shopping. And now I'm just completely stuck. And I don't I don't know what's caused this. So that's life. I can't live like this. <laughs> 